Save data has been updated. All right, save data has been updated. It's weird. For once, I didn't actually have to delay the stream because of an update. Normally, the stream does. Normally, it's Animal Crossing doesn't update, and I, like the stream, like it takes me like a few minutes to get the download. No, it was already downloaded for once. Hmm, weird. That's never actually happened before. Oh god, we're still and we're still in the middle of um t-shirts. Yay. Yay. I don't know, we should still be uh, assuming the game lets us build a pumpkin patch today, we should be able to build a pumpkin patch today. I don't honestly know if it'll let us. But we'll find out. Hello there, everyone. Right now it's 5:01 on Wednesday, September 30th. Isn't there any news to share today? Come to think of it, September is on its way out, and it'll be on the brisk side soon. Time to switch over to those fall wardrobes. Nope, don't have one. I can't wait to see what sorts of outfits you have. I mean, we'll definitely get some spooky stuff done for spooky month. Spooky. But when it comes to a fallout to hit, nope, not even close. No idea. No ideas whatsoever. Oh, so that's the uh, wing. F we are uh, the ring from Nintendo. Yeah, they gave everyone a ring. Uh, the we, f not we fit. Uh, ring fit adventure ring. It's part of the new update. Because I don't know, they like to do stuff like that. So hey, we have one now. What is that? Oh, it's just some it's just some shit. I was like, what's this notification? Just some shit I don't care about. Alright. Gosh dang it, I hate that shirt. So I did not record the core video yesterday. I got sidetracked with other shit. And I never got around to it. Uh praise beyond to Helix. I'll probably do it tomorrow at some point or today maybe today. Most likely tomorrow. I don't know, there's a big South Park special coming out today, and I, I don't know, I still kind of enjoy South Park. I, I know there are some people who are like, oh, South Park's right way past its expiration date. I don't know, I don't really agree. Today is not a fruit day, yeah. Tomorrow is, though. Tomorrow's a fruit day, but hey, it'll be fine, we'll talk about Smash Bros. Because I definitely have a lot to say about Smish. I mean, we're going to talk about Smash today as well, but... Fuck me! God damn it, that could it could have been anywhere. It... God damn it. How did we get one? How did we get one? Labels here today, I don't even care. People are having fun in the plaza, though. Running around with Swiffers. Or, like, little dusting rags, you know what I mean. What? I would- no, I would think that would be covered. Fuck me. Yeah, well, I guess there's a t-shirt right there, but not one right there, so... Fuck. Because, goddammit, the one right here was there yesterday. I don't... How did we get one rock? Like, seriously. Like, our... I don't know how we got one. F this is our life. This is our hell for the next month. Oh, please, uh... Uh, snurch. Bless me. Let me get these good rocks. God damn it. Ah. 
There's a weed. Nothing in... And I know uh, there are still probably spots within the flower garden where they can spawn. I can almost guarantee it that there are spots within here that something can spawn. Fuck me. Nothing. Nothing. I, I also realize we haven't been collecting the bottle the past few days as well. Like, I don't even know. I might have just completely skipped past the bottle. I, I don't even think I've seen it in the past few days. So I should look for that today as well. Because I just don't think I've seen it. They're pro it's probably up near the campsite. Pro they probably both are. Ugh. Ah, screw it. This isn't worth my time. There's our money tree. I mean, I'll take a money tree, sure. I'm just so annoyed with the rock. Like, we should have... That should have been perfect. And it's just because I forgot that one t-shirt right there. That's what screwed up everything. Okay, there's one over there. I didn't even notice that earlier. Because, but, of course, because of that t-shirt right there, we can't actually get over here. I wonder how forked up this area is. You know, like, can, can something come spawn right here? I don't know, maybe. Hey, Whitney, why are you sitting next to these t-shirts? How'd you do, Snappy? Time moves a bit more leisurely here on the island. If I don't watch it, the clock, the day ends before you know it. Eh, it all depends. It all depends. It's it's got to be up here somewhere. Huh. That's weird. I, I would have sworn it was going to be in here somewhere. Oh, you know where else it could be? Oh, here's the money spot. That's fairly hidden. But you know where else it totally could be, though? That I can think of? Near the uh, rock garden. That's, I don't think, an area we really checked out. There it is. Shit. Alright, let's take these to the museum. Yeah, everyone's just kind of in town hall right now. Huh. 
And we'll go buy some fruit, fix that up, water some flowers, and hopefully go buy some pumpkin stuff. We got a lot of pumpkin stuff to work on. Sass fossils. Pumpkin, pumpkin, pumpkin hype. Yep, pumpkin hype. Of course, I'm assuming you can buy them as of right now. I haven't actually gone into the store to check. I haven't gone in. We're going to go do that right now. I should also pull up turnips. Ooh, let me, let me pull up turnips as well. Uh, no. Oops. Fortunately, it's on October 1st. You can s Really? Ah, god damn it. All my plans for today were rooted around starting a pumpkin patch. Gosh dang it, really? I was, uh, you know, I, I wrote the thing, I wrote the stream notification today and was like, you know, there is a chance you can't buy pumpkins today. Shit. T R I whatever. I'll just wait until tomorrow. Gosh, well, because we're doing the pumpkin patch tomorrow, then, if we can't do it today. Yeah. I do need to buy a peach, though. Because our rock, cause my rock garden screwed up again. Because of course it did. Of course it did. I'm, I forgot to check turnips. Shit. I am never going to be free from this rock garden. Came and I dropped off a good 130, made a big plot about three days ago. I've got a plot, I just haven't. I need to clear it out a little bit, but it'll take like a minute to clear it out. It won't be hard. Okay, let's put one directly where the rock was. Display here. Let's actually move it halfway up. And then we can put another one right here. There we go. Okay, that should get all of that now. We should hopefully be good. We should hopefully be good. Oh, God. When will my nightmare end? That means this other rock is a money rock. Now that I'm thinking about it. So we do have some news today. The new um, Smash Bros. update did get... um Informate... Right? We got information uh, that there's going to be a Smash Bros. announcement tomorrow. We don't know what it's going to be. The presentation's, I think, three minutes in length. Plus uh, an announcement from Sakurai at the end. But it's probably just going to... We're not getting a character overview or anything. We'll probably just be like, Hey, here's the uh, here's a character trailer. And then we'll probably find out the release date. Or at least the time of the next presentation. Somewhere in mid... In late to... Late October to early November. We'll find out the next event, and where, that's when the character comes out. We're not; it's not getting shadow dropped today or anything. So I, my guess would be we'd probably get another event. I don't know; we may not, but that would be my guess. A dublet. Uh, I don't have a skirt, but I don't need one. I'll buy a nightgown. I'm sure I can use a nightgown for something. I'm sure I can find something weird to do with that. But yeah, if I had to guess... So what characters could it be? Actually, let, let me do turnips first. I, I have a few characters I wrote down. 
My first guess, though, is Rex and Pyra. I know fans of Xenoblade Chronicles will say that, oh, in Xenoblade Chronicles 2, there are more interesting characters. But if it's going to be a character from Xenoblade Chronicles 2, it's going to be Rex and Pyra. Do I, is it going to be Rex and Pyra? I don't know. I don't think so. I still hope it'll happen, but I don't think so. I don't know. I just, I like that thing about last time Chugga Conroy did Xenoblade. It was, um... It was a, uh, last time he let's play Xenoblade 2. Xenoblade 2 remake, please? What? What? D didn't that game just come out, like, three years ago? <laughs> I don't know, I still, <laughs> I still really haven't played it, but I'm, I'm expecting, I, that would not be one, I, if that, if Rex and Pyra happened, I would in no way be surprised. Oh, I'm stuck between two shirts. It did. Uh, but with that being said, so a Zen right a remake, I still could see them announce Elma, right? If we don't get Rex and Pyra, I could see them announce Elma as the character and announce a remake of X. Cuz I'm sure cuz I know cuz X ends on a cliffhanger and hopefully we'll get a sequel one of these days. And when we do get an X sequel, I bet they'd want the original X to be out on Switch for more people to play it. So if it's Elma, I don't, I don't know. It'd be kind of, I could see Rex and Pyro before I could see Elma. I mean, if this was back in the day, maybe not. But like nowadays, no, I see Rex and Pyro more. Because Sakurai even admitted to wanting Rex in the game. He's outright said it before. I don't know. It's just the Chugger Conroy thing. I laugh at. That's it. There's that's not evidence or anything. It's just it's funny. Um, the next one is we did get a Pokemon announcement yesterday, so there is a chance this new reveal is a Pokemon reveal. That's no guarantee or anything, but there is a chance that this is a Pokemon reveal. I personally hate the idea of this being a Pokemon reveal. We've had Pokemon characters in the past. Right. I, I wasn't even on for favor with Incineroar. I, I kind of thought Incineroar was unnecessary. That was my personal opinion. And, yeah, I still kind of stand by that. Yeah, we'll clear this all out tomorrow. I didn't buy the DLC for Smash. I want to see what they do. I So... I bought the original DLC pack, right, with uh, Banjo, Byleth, Terry, Hero, Joker, and the other one. But I have not bought the new DLC pack with just Min Min. I am waiting to see what characters they announce. If they announce someone cool, I'll buy it. But so far, Min Min has not been enough to, like, persuade me or anything. Fuck. With our pumpkin patch pa patch revealed. Ugh. Uh, let's talk to Label. But yeah, so Rex and Pyra is just one idea. The other, um, the Pokemon, I, I don't want, I don't care for a Pokemon. I personally don't want one. I know some people would be like, oh, it'd be cool to get, like, the Gorilla, a work outfit. Okay. Honestly, this is a work outfit. The Gorilla, uh, Boom. I don't know. I don't remember. I remember Cinderace and that's it. Would be, eh... I don't know, I'm kind of sick of fire fire types, and I feel like doing Cinderace would just kind of... Try okay, I'll, I'll put on a suit. That's what you want, Mabel. But yeah, I don't care for Cinderace. I don't care for Rillaboom. I So that leaves Inteleon, who might be okay, but I just... No, I don't want a Pokemon. I feel like a Pokemon would kind of suck. Right, like there are so many more interesting characters you can fit in. To stick us with another Pokemon would be kind of lame. I've seen a few islands surprised at how small they make pumpkin patches. So we got our ring con. Does it does it squeeze? Yes, it does squeeze. Loop. Yeah. Uh, the next one is Crash Bandicoot. Crash Crash 4 does come out tomorrow or Friday at one of those two days. 
So Crash Bandicoot 4 does come out very soon. And that could mean we get more... Um, that could mean Crash Bandicoot. Again, there's nothing... These are just people just, like taking stabs in the dark. I, I'd be fine with Crash Bandicoot. I think he would... I think Crash Bandicoot would fit into the series, definitely. There's a lot of potential there. Um, of course, the, the thing is, like, hey, what if there is a Crash Bandicoot Easter egg in the new Crash game? And the reason why they're pushing out this reveal is because if they... Right? Because people will find that Easter egg. I mean, I can't guarantee anything, but, huh. I don't like making guesses. I just wait and see. I mean, I might as well make guesses because I have nothing better to do. I mean, like, what, what else am I going to do? I mean, my biggest hope is that it's something that really surprises me. My biggest hope is always that it's, like, some big surprise. Some sort of, like, big ordeal. But I'll just... I mean, I might as well... I've got nothing better to do. Loafers. Sure. Work outfit. Damn. Um, but yeah, Crash... Com but yeah, like, imagine, like, in the new Crash Bandicoot game, there's a Smash Bros. Easter egg, and you only... And so, th like, critics already know who the character is because of the Smash Bros. Easter egg. So it's just like, hey, we might as well get this out before the public gets the game. I mean, I'm not I'm not guaranteeing that happens, like, at all. Like, there's probably, like, a 0.01% chance that that's how it plays. But you never know. I mean, I could see Crash Bandicoot. Those are the big three that everyone seems to be talking about. Of course, there are always the classics, right? The characters people keep talking about every fucking time and honestly i'm so tired of hearing about them that i kind of don't want them to be in the game even though like i kind of get it i'm just so tired those the two are specifically sora and gino don't get me wrong kingdom hearts fans right i know there are kingdom Hearts fans and i do agree that the evidence against like kingdom hearts is very minuscule but god damn it, every time, they're so fucking annoying. If it happens, just let it happen. Same thing with Gino. I get people want Gino. Gino was kind of a, right, G people have wanted Gino since, like, what, Melee? But it's, t it's time to stop. It's time to give it a rest. It really is. I'm so sick and tired of Gino. Gino talk. It, and it's going to keep going. Like, there's nothing I can do. Nothing any of us can do to stop it. Uh, I wish I had better pants in this game. It's already toxic, don't, so I don't bite into it. I just I just see it on Twitter. Honestly, like, I'm, like, at, of course, a lot of people in the Smash... Uh, it, that was the fighting community. We're outed as pedophiles. But, like, even without that, no. Smash community is pretty toxic. But, much like the presidential debate last night... There was no way to avoid it. It was everywhere on Twitter. And yeah, I'm just kind of like, ah, God. But yeah, Sora and Gino are the ones that were, of course, tr when, it, when Smash was trending, so was Sora and Gino. Because of course Sora and Gino were trending. <laughs> Do I just have a normal... No. I mean, that works. But yeah, and then the other one is... Uh, I've been seeing a lot of people talk about 2B recently, or Travis Touchdown. Didn't watch it. Didn't feel like two idiots. I did watch the presidential debate. It was fucking terrible. It was... I'm not going to watch the uh, the other two. But this, this one was fucking terrible. They were two idiots. Um... Ooh. Thinking of the presidential... Well, welcome to the most cringy thing I'm going to ever do. But, uh, we might as well. But no, the presidential debate was terrible. Oh my god. And then Trump telling white supremacists to stand back and stand by. Fuck him and fuck him hard. Man, go... Oh my fucking god. But you know, I do... We don't... I don't have signs in this game, do I? Because 
I was like, you know, I could do the most cringy thing I've ever done. But I don't think there's a way to make a custom sign. I know there is, but this one doesn't work. Because I have been joking about doing this in the past. Yeah, I know there is a custom signpost. I just don't have it. I guess an easel will work. I wonder if this is... I know this is a thing, but I wonder if I can find it. Oh, God. Should I... Ooh, I'm, I'm afraid of what I'm going to find. You know, fuck... I mean, we've gotten political before. I mean, I, I can... I'm not a Nazi. That's all the president has to do. Just imagine the flyover seeing all those t-shirts. So we can search by criteria. Let's see. Can can I find what I'm looking for? I know this exists. Because I know there's official ones you can get. Yeah. Yeah. Any good ones? I actually kind of like that one. Uh, fuck it. Well, let's get political. I mean, nothing stopped us before. Let's fucking get political. Man, fuck Donald Trump. F fuck him. Biden Harris. I was honestly, when I searched it up, I was expecting to see some terrible shit. That, but no, it was actually wasn't that bad. Fuck it, we've got nothing else to do. Let's get fucking political, shall we? Let's get political. <laughs> Let's replace all of these t-shirts with one that <laughs> Oh, fuck, I should have done that. I should have done that, fuck. Oh, God, that would have been so funny. I need to get a signpost, though. I know they exist, but I know the custom ones don't work that way. Because I tried. Because I tried in the past, and it didn't work that way. So, I guess for the moment... Oh, you know what? We're also going to go talk to Tom Nook as well. Hey, it's Carmen. Yep, Carmen's great. Display here. As a painting. I'll get a signpost later. But boom. We, we've gotten. Welcome to Political Animal Crossing. Biden-Harris 2020. Yep. Showing my support. One step at a time. Elections are. Almost a month away. So. Yeah. Alright, uh, did I have any more Smash Bros. news? I said 2B and, um... Let's go talk to Tom Nook. I said 2B and Travis Touchdown are characters people are talking about. I could see either of them happen. I, I, I loved the... I read this a few days ago. I, I think I read it on stream. The argument that uh, tra uh, 2B could totally get into the game because she's an anime sword fighter character. I mean, she doesn't have blue hair, but the rest is pretty solid. I could see that. I could see that. I don't know. I I've never... I own Nier Automata now. I bought it last week, but I've never actually played it, so... I don't know anything... I don't know anything about Rex and... Po or about 2B. So, we'll see. Uh, but yeah, that's, it could be, honestly, my hope is that, my, my, of course, my personal hope. Shit, did we not talk, check this yesterday? My personal hope is still Doom Guy. I still just love the idea of Doom Guy. I, it's so funny in my head, and I would love to see it, but I don't think it's going to happen. I think I have Samba. I'll check. But I think I have Samba. And isn't the, isn't the moon thing tomorrow as well? Isn't the moon viewing thing? It's either the first or the second. That's that's coming up soon. The the harvest moon? It might be tomorrow, though. I don't remember. Let's make our house spooky. So at least on, on Halloween we can have a spooky house. Uh, next up in the news, uh, Jump Rope Challenge. Nintendo released like this really like 
this like jump rope game way earlier in like May. That was like, hey, jump rope, right? See how many jump ropes you can do. And it was supposed to be like Nintendo's like little freebie exercise thing that they said in a few months they were going to take down. And it was supposed to be taken down, I want to say today or tomorrow. And Nintendo has decided they're not going to take it down. That's a good thing. Because that that gives me hope for future things. Like the Mario 35 or that... um. That Zelda, th or not the Zelda thing, that the Mario 35, or the um the other one. Let's go with that one. The uh the the Mario 35th anniversary collection. That that's what I meant. The 3D All Stars. Um, that gives me hope that those games aren't going to be taken down. There's no guarantee of it, but it gives me hope that hey, if this jump rope challenge stayed up, because there's no reason to take it down. It's not like jump rope challenge is taking up any extra storage space, you know. So I'm between that one and that one. I think I like that one better. And then door-wise, oh, where uh, that this this one isn't bad, but I like this one. Ooh, I don't know. The the black's a little. The the black is very black on that. That one, that's also not bad. I don't want a porthole. I don't need a generic door. Those don't work. I don't know. The black is very black on that. I, I, I think I did kind of warm up... To, not to the Zen door. To the um, iron door. They're, they're both good in their own ways. Um, Let's go with iron. And let's do a mailbox. Welcome to the... Or should I... Actually, is there a... There's yellow. Is there an orange? No, not really. Because Halloween colors are black and orange. And I guess a little purple. That's blue. Eh, well, let's just go with the black house. Halloween, it's spooky month. Um, but yeah, so jump rope. So that gives me hope for the future. We'll see. I don't know. I, I don't have really high expectations. But you never know. Next up, Minecraft Live is coming up. Um, I've been considering talking about this. I, I still play Minecraft all the time. Still a super fun game. And in Minecraft Live, they usually do some... For the past few years, they do, like, some sort of vote. Where it's like, hey, vote on what's coming to the game next. I kind of wish it was more of a thing where I was like, hey, vote on what's coming soon... Like, coming first. And I kind of wish they did all of them. But no, they do the one... And then the other... Like, they a few years ago, they voted on, like, four mobs. And the Phantom one? Which, eh, the Phantom's kind of dumb. But I, would, I was always curious to see what the other mobs were like. But I guess we'll never know. I guess we'll never know. Because I was... And then the biome thing. I know they recently did one of the biomes. Was it the snow biome? I think they did the... Because they added berries and foxes and whatnot. This year they're doing three more mobs. The Moo Bloom. Which I swear I've seen fan art of for years now. It's like a cow with flowers on it. I don't really know. The Isolager, which is like an ice villager, or an ice illager that like shoots ice at you. Honestly, that one looks pretty decent. Or then there's the uh, gl the glow squid, which I ki design wise, I kind of really like, but I just don't think it'll do anything that interesting. So I don't really have much high hopes for it. Because the, squ the normal squid doesn't really do anything. I mean, they make a hypnotism joke in the thing. So like maybe that's hinting at something, but... It probably also isn't. Is this what I think it is? Yeah. So, I don't know. We'll see. But yeah, that's that's October. That's Saturday, I think, is the actual Minecraft Live. I'm sure they'll talk about the new update, and we'll talk about it then, because, again, I still love me some Minecraft. It's so much fun.
I still find so much fun with it. And then finally, um, they showed off. They talked about Insomniac. Talked about Spider Man PS Five. So, or well, so we know about Spider Man Miles Morales, and we know what's coming with that game, right? But as part of it, they're selling Spider Man Remastered. Or as if you basically, it's if you buy Sp the deluxe edition of Miles Morales, you get a you get basically an enhanced version of Spider-Man on PS4. I've played through Spider-Man on PS4. I played through it earlier this year. Loved it. It's going to be on the Game of the Year list. I can already tell you that. But they announced that Spider-Man, um, as part of the remaster, right, they're going back through there, enhancing the visuals and all that. Also, you can't buy it standalone for some reason. That's kind of dumb, but okay, whatever. But as part of them enhancing the visuals, they had to go and get... Uh, for some reason, the actor they had playing Spider-Man, like, cause so Yuri Lowenthal is the voice actor, but they had like a different actor like doing like the motion capture, and for some reason, they changed the motion capture. I think it. I think their reasoning was because the actual like motion capture person they got wasn't like it wasn't matching up as well as it should. So it was kind of like, hey, right? So they decided to get somebody new. So this is just, so I just pulled up Twitter and this was the first tweet I found that had it. So, right, you've got, you got him, you got, uh, this is the, so this is how it looks on the PS4 right now, right? That's the actor. It, honestly, it, it kind of, he's 23 years old, or at least he's supposed to be. And I don't know, it looked kind of weird at first, but I got used to it. I'm like, okay, that's Spider-Man. Because clearly this was going for a slightly older Spider-Man, because we're used to high, like, all the movies do high school Spider-Mans. But this was clearly going for a little older, but not as old as, like, Peter B. Parker in the, um in the uh into the spider verse so that's the ps4 version this is the ps5 version yeah um i've seen a lot of people complaining about this today like i've seen a lot of complaints i've seen a lot of people say that it looks like tom holland right that this looks more like tom holland than the previous guy did but honestly i'm fine with this I think this looks fine. It looks just like I can still see, right? It's clear that honestly, it kind of looks more like Spider-Man than the previous one did. I'll, I'll be honest, like just for, like my mental image of Spider-Man. I I'm honestly fine with it. I like, I wonder what happened behind the scenes. Like, is there, like, I don't think there was any sort of, at least if there was some sort of like falling out between the original mocap actor and the new one, they haven't hinted, right? Nobody said anything about it. There is, at least from what I've seen, that's more of, like, fan speculation and whatnot. But, yeah, but one of the things people have complained is that he looks younger. Like, he looks about the same age as Miles Morales does in, um, right, in, right? And I kind of see it. Because I, I, the actual actor who's playing him now is, I want to say, 26? I don't know how old the previous guy was. I mean, look at Tom Holland. Tom Holland is, I think, older than me, even. And he looks way younger than me. Admittedly, I have a beard, but still. I, I don't... I don't know. Yes, I do kind of see how it's closer to Tom Holland. But honestly, I don't have a problem with it. I think it looks fine. I get why... I kind of get... Right? It's, it's, a, it's just... This is a very weird thing. And you know, part of the reason for them announcing it... Is because they're he's going to look different in Spider-Man Miles Morales, so they're just like, hey, you know what? Let's just retroactively instead of like, hey, the new one's gonna have the same voice actor and the old or the, the mocap actor, and the old one's gonna have the old one. They just like uni universalized it. I don't know. That could be one of the reasons. That totally could be. I don't know. It's just we are in this. It's this is a weird thing that. I mean, like, but if it was between games, sure, right? If this was, if this guy was the new Spider-Man, and the new and the Miles Morales game and Spider-Man Two and onwards, and, and it's still, and it's also important. Yuri Lowenthal is still voicing Spider-Man, right? The voice actor didn't change. Part of their reasoning, I think, was that the new voice actor matches Yuri's voice acting better, right? The mocap better. 
right? That was like a problem, I guess they were coming across or something. I don't, I don't know. It's, it's just, these are weird circumstances. These are, to see them go back and change the previous thing. I mean, this is like George Lucas level shit right here. But as far as I know, they also aren't updating the um, old game, right? Like the PS4 version isn't getting updated at all. So yeah, this is just for the new version. I don't know. It's weird. It's a weird thing that hasn't really been done before. But I mean, I guess I'm f right. Sure. Sure, it's, it's new and different, but it's fine. Hey, Whitney. Ah. What's the latest? I like your biker jacket. <laughs> God, everyone's here. It's a comfy season. Yeah, look at that. Everyone's here. That's half the island. That's crazy. Hey, how's it? Yeah, it's so weird that they write the cranky character as old men. Octavian doesn't even have hair. It's it's one of the weirder things in the game. And there's Tammy. Yeah. I know there is a signpost as well. Like that's what that's what drives me crazy. Is I've seen people with an actual signpost. And I thought I got the D when I got the DR recipe for signpost, that was like good enough. But it wasn't, much to my surprise. Let's see what I know I made one. Somewhere's in here. Is it in? Let's grab. I was going to grab the customization kits, but I must have skipped past them. There they were. Okay, I'm looking for a signpost. Not this one. It is cool, though, we finally got a diner sign. That took forever to get. There's the wedding sign, but that's not what I'm looking for either. There it is. Sign post. Let's customize. So, yeah, there's that. There's home, forest, fishing spot, resident services, airport shop, tailor, and museum. But there's not custom one. And I'm just, I'm, I'm assuming that means custom sign is a different DIY recipe, right? There's like a different like wooden sign or whatever. And I just don't have that yet. Because that's the one I do want. Ah, it just kind of sucks. Uh, we'll need all the money tomorrow when we buy, um, what's it called? When we buy pumpkins, so yeah. Yeah, um, I'm excited for, I don't know when we're streaming tomorrow. I do have to go for, I, even though tomorrow is normally my day off, I do actually have to go in for class tomorrow. Like, I gotta go in and do something. But that's a little, I don't know, that's around midday, so. Uh. I don't know. I, I, um, other than that, other than that, I, I don't know. We'll figure out the rest. But yeah, I'm going to do the pumpkin patch tomorrow. We'll talk about Smash Bros. Tomorrow is also a fruit day, which is going to be hell in a handbasket. But hey, we'll get to that when we get to that. Okay. Yeah, that's where we're going to... I'm going to go watch... I think the new South Park airs in like a few minutes, so I'm going to go watch that. <laughs> Maybe it'll be good. Maybe it will be. You know, so OBS... So I use OBS. They added a new s virtual camera? What is that? 
I, I took, I took, I feel like OBS is running smoother. Like, there's definitely some polish in the new update. But there's a start virtual camera. I wonder what that is. I haven't messed around with it, and I haven't Googled it yet. Maybe I should, I don't know, because I know virtual streamers are getting more and more popular. So I wonder if it has something to do with that. I do wonder, because, yeah, virtual streamer, I mean... More and more people are becoming one. Uh, I, again, I've I've said my piece on the past, the past. But yeah, I'm gonna go watch the new South Park. Uh, we can talk about we'll talk about it tomorrow probably because I have nothing better to do. But yeah, um, and we'll talk about Smash Bros. But yeah, I hope you all enjoyed. Stay tuned for more. Until next time, peace.